Kai Reed and Kiera Carter add another layer to this game. Best friends from birth because they're siblings. Both went to Michigan State. Kai Reed, a manager on the women's basketball team, and Kiera played for the Spartans as a walk-on. And these two, it's pretty cool to see them both in the dome, coaching against each other for the first time. And their hopefully long careers. Kiera Wagner, assistant coach in her first year with the Seahawks, and Kai Reed came over from Buffalo with Felicia Leggett Jack, and he's in his first season as Syracuse's assistant coach. You can always find cool storylines when you send out the schedule, and Casey Kai Reed Carter told us before the game that the schedule came out, and he looked over at his sister and said, Wow, we're really playing each other in the first season? Yeah. And not only we're really playing each other, but he probably said something along the lines of, wow, I'm really going to beat you in the first <laughs> season because that's how competitive they are. I'm in trying to beat the Seahawks with a three. Can't do it there. They'll go Wagner's way, and it's a family affair, not just between those two, but the whole Carter family is here right in the middle. Quentin Carter, who's actually the vice president of studio production for the Big Ten Network. He's been in that role ever since 2007 as a coordinating producer. It's cool to see the whole family here, grandparents, Kai Reed's family, Quentin, and their mom, Simone. Wabudu, the jumper is pure. How about Kem Wabudu, the fifth year, up to eight points? Wagner team that scores the most points in the NEC, 64 a game. Bear scores the most points on this team, around 19, but can't get that jumper to fall. It seems like they're already making her uncomfortable, forcing her to take shots that she doesn't want to take, off balance. And if that's what they do the rest of this game, if they keep her quiet, they have a good chance of outscoring Syracuse in the late, later stages. Thibault throws it away. Great positioning by Strong down low. So what you have to do with De'Asia Fair, one of the most talented guards over the last three, four years in the country. 19 points per game, five assists per game is Georgia Woolley. Last year's MAC Freshman of the Year takes the seat. De'Asia Fair was also MAC Freshman of the Year back in her freshman season. Then she would go on to be top five in the nation in scoring two out of the next three years. Strong with a mismatch. Cheyenne McEvans, another Buffalo transfer, just checked into the ball game. Fair, step back. Miss left, another miss jumper, rebound Lewis. That's the line to shoot two. The layer that Syracuse has with Dariana Lewis, the transfer from Alabama A&M, averages over 10 rebounds per game, and she's getting it done on the offensive end. She's going to be an issue for Wagner throughout this ball game. Every time that she's down low, she's the first one to put her head up toward the rim on a shot and box out. Boxing out is going to be key in this one, and Coach Jack prides her team on getting rebounds. Dariana Lewis is a prime example of that. And Dariana Lewis entered the transfer portal. Coach Leggett Jack for Syracuse, 12 to 15 minutes later, looked at the rest of her coaching staff and said, someone shoot her a DM. One of the best rebounders in the nation was second in rebounds in the entire country last season for Alabama A&M. And she said, hey, that's a player that can rebound with the best of them. And they went 100 miles per hour with her recruiting process because it was so late in the summer. She called her style of play the Dennis Rodman style <laughs> of play. Not afraid of anybody and will rebound the heck out of the ball. Well, Voodoo not afraid already with eight points, but misses on that short hook. Fair. Asia Fair still scoreless. Into Strong. Tough move. Lewis again the board. We're going to stay on this end. Dariana Lewis is dominating Julia Fabazi, who just entered this game, the consummate sixth woman on the team. She's doing everything possible to get every O board. Yeah, and watch, Lewis, first one to it once the ball comes down off the rim. First of all, nice move from Strong to kind of try and put her shoulder down and scoop it up and in. But Dariana Lewis is insistent on making sure that she's the first one to the rebound. And Syracuse shift their focus on offense, shot just 21% from three-point range through the first four games. They've gotten better at it, but it allowed them to toughen up inside. 
And now you're seeing it come to fruition early on in the season. Outscored Colgate 40 to 8 in the paint. And that just shows the two dimensional nature of the Syracuse offense. And they're going to have to play a lot of teams that are aggressive on the inside to come ACC play. So if you can be out, uh, uh, out aggressive, these teams like, out of, like Wagner out of conference, that's going to help you moving forward. The Asia Fair held up with the newly inserted Wagner Seahawk, Angela Ricard. They were back in the game 21 in green for Bozy Sits. Pull up, misses short. Sanchez Henry, not enough mustard on it. Hyman runs the floor. Lewis to Strong, great, great pass. So pivotal in transition to find the open woman and Asia Strong right there to lay it in. A lot of times Syracuse takes the shot clock and they use as much of it as they can, but they pass the ball so well. It's about ball movement. If you pass the ball really quickly between your players, the defense will never be able to catch up, and that's a prime example of it. Corner three, Ricard way long. Time and another board. Eyes already up. Behind the back. Throws it up and is short. Lewis to put back. And SU head coach Felicia Leggett Jack is jumping up and down. She's loving it. How about that? Dariana Lewis flying out of nowhere. That's where she talks about that Dennis Rodman style of play. Seven points, three rebounds for Dariana Lewis. A foul on Asia Strong. And as Coach Leggett Jack talks it over with Mick Evans and Strong, the trailer, Dariana Lewis says, hey, if you're going to miss it, I'll put it right back. Yeah, Hyman had the ball on a string. When she went up, it was a little off balance, but Lewis just rises up and gets that rebound, as she's done so many times already tonight. To think that Dariana Lewis, is just strong, checks out of the game. Kyra Wood, another Buffalo transfer, into the ball game. Lewis started playing in high school. For someone that's so dominant at the collegiate level in her fifth year, to think she started playing at high school, not middle school or earlier, I'm in. There's the steal. Crossover. The floater. No, Lewis again. Can anyone box her out? Dariana Lewis up to nine points and four rebounds that feel like ten. A timeout with a minute 39 to play in this first quarter, and it's all cues.